Okay, so I wanted to do a, a quick little demo of uh, how you can use the Moodle mobile app uh, on your phone. I'm working on an iPhone here, but it's available for Android as well. We've got directions at the TLTC um, website about how to um, configure the Moodle mobile app to log into our Moodle system at purchase. If you log in, um, you'll actually see a... Um, a representation of the Moodle homepage, the site uh, homepage, uh, but there will also be a tab at the top that says Dashboard, and you'll want to click over to your Dashboard. If you look under your in-progress courses on the Dashboard, you'll see the tile for our Search for Life in the Universe course. Uh, it should be pretty obvious because I'm probably the only instructor um, that's bothered to put an image in for the course description on the tile here. Click on it and you will go into our course. Uh, there are a variety of uh, you know, different options here, but mainly if you're working on your phone to try to keep up with the course, you, we want to um, focus on the contents. Uh, which will list all of the resources and activities uh, for the course. I've got our current Introduction to Astrobiology section um, highlighted here. So you see the section description. You see all of the resources and activities that are uh, under this, uh, this section. If you, uh, you know, click on the uh, page resource that has the directions for this week, You'll see the overview, the outcomes, uh, the list of the resources, the learning activities, other interesting things. Um, I mean, this, uh, this video from NASA will actually play through fine. Watch it on your phone. Stop it the way you would normally stop a video. Go back. We've got two links here to... Um, the annotation assignments at our perusal space that's attached to our course, they actually work. If you click on this external link, it'll say launch the activity. You click launch the activity and you are in, um, you're in the uh, article and you can you know, select text, you can add comments, you can look to see what uh, the um, comments that are already there are and follow any of them and reply. When you're finished, uh, you want to hit the done down in the lower left hand corner. That will take you back into Moodle. You can go back out to um, you know this uh, section of the front page. The other perusal activity you know will work the same way. And um, you know again you would be able to uh, play through the video for the, um, you know this assignment. Click the add comment wherever you want to add um, a, a, a comment. Again, uh, hit done on the lower left hand corner. Go back out. Uh, if you um, click on the quiz activity, you'll see the description of uh, you know that's a, that's attached to it and, and listing all of the different uh, resources that the quiz covers. It tells you you've got five attempts. You know, please make use of all five of your attempts. It tells you when the quiz opens, when it closes. There is a time limit. Every time you take the quiz, you've got to you know take it within twenty minutes, unless you've got uh, an accommodation and you would just click uh, attempt to quiz now. But I won't bother because I'm not a student in the course. Uh, and then you would, um, you know, just, uh, they're mostly multiple choice questions. You would just uh, select the different multiple choice options and go through the 10 questions and hit submit. And again, remember, you've got five attempts of that. Um, same thing with the group discussions. If you click on here, you would go into the discussion forum. It's a Q&A forum. You would, have, you would see the one question you would need to go in to. And... Um, uh, I'm not a member of any of the groups, so it's a little bit different view for me on the mobile device than it would be for you. You would basically just be in here. You'd see the description of the Q&A discussion forum. You would see a place where you could um, uh, enter into that existing question that I set up for each of the groups. You would add your 
response to the question, then you'd be able to see everyone else's responses. The idea is to have a conversation with other members in your group to come up with a top five list of you know, important questions for astrobiology. And, you know, that's pretty much it. It's, um, if you are working on your phone, um, this view from the mobile app, uh, the Moodle mobile app is a lot nicer than trying to, you know, open up the web browser on your phone and deal with the, um, you know, the the Moodle course interface, which is fine on a larger device, but it gets kind of crowded on a small device like a phone. So um, I encourage you, if you are working on your phone, to uh, download the Moodle app, um, contact the TLTC at tltc at purchase.edu, and we can direct you to where the, um, the configuration, the setup instructions are. You get... Um, you can get uh, the mobile mobile app, mobile app configured on your phone to just automatically log into our purchase system. You'll see your courses, and you have a nice, convenient mobile way to keep up uh, with your courses.